Hey guys, just wanted to show you what I'm working on here. It's my old Harley, and it's been sitting all winter. The um, battery is totally flat. I took it out of the bike to uh, keep it in my apartment warm over the winter, but when I put it in, it was totally dead. And uh, I've got one of these SeaTac chargers that I connected to it. But the charger refused to um, begin charging. It would it would run on the recon mode for a few minutes, and then it would go to a flashing uh, power LED, which the manual says is a bad battery. It's a not chargeable battery. So I have a little trick to to try. Sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. Um, what I do is I've got this. Uh, transformer style charger all this really is is a hundred milliamp I think it's a 13 volt uh, hundred milliamp power supply so it sends out a really really weak trickle and I uh, find that if you take this unit which I bought I think a Canadian tire was about $30 and you connect it to one of these totally flat batteries either motorcycle battery car battery lawn tractor battery any kind of 12 volt battery that will not start one of these chargers. Um, hook up this baby, 100 milliamp, uh, 12 to 14 volt DC transformer. Um, just got a couple of simple alligator clips on it like that. Uh, connect it by itself to this battery, plug it in, and it'll have a power light and a charge light. And you'll probably see that when you connect it, the char power light will be bright, the charge light will be very very dim if not lit at all just let it sit i let this sit for about half an hour and very slowly the charging light started to to come on very dim after about a half hour it was as bright as the power light which indicates that power is flowing into this battery at that point disconnect the battery well or leave it connected to this charger if you want I disconnect it from this charger, reconnect the SeaTech, plug the SeaTech in, and the SeaTech immediately begins um, reconditioning this battery. Now, it doesn't necessarily mean to say that this battery is going to be any good when it's charged, but for what the cost is of these, it's definitely worth giving it a try uh, before running out and buying a new one. If it's garbage, it's garbage. you got to replace it. But if this does work, you just saved yourself probably about $100. So just wanted to show you that. If you got one of these and it doesn't seem to start up on dead, dead batteries, try trickle charging it off a transformer for half an hour, 45 minutes, then switch it over. That's a little tip. Thanks for watching.